Do wolf dogs make good pets? You might think of wolves as being independent and perhaps even dangerous. And while that can be true of wolves in the wild, many dogs descended from or crossbred with wolves tend to be extremely sociable, gentle, and playful. Wolf dog hybrid is a term used to describe an animal that is part wolf and part domestic dog. Dogs, Canis lupus familiaris, and wolves, Canis lupus, share an evolutionary past and thus share many physical and behavioral traits. Wolf dogs are any breed that has wolf content in their genetic makeup. This means that any cross breed with a dog and wolf is considered a wolf dog. Because wolves and dogs are so similar, they're able to mate with each other, producing a hybrid species, a mix between the two. These hybrids, of course, come with their own set of specific needs. First of all, they get big, like anywhere from 26 to 34 inches high and ranging between 60 and 120 pounds. Second, they're known to be high maintenance in terms of shedding, a need for attention and exercise, and more. Here are 12 gorgeous wolf dog breeds. 12. Northern Inuit Dog Northern Inuit dogs were an attempt to create a wolf-like breed with the temperament of a dog. It's speculated this dog originates in the UK during the 1980s by mixing Malamute, Siberian Husky, and German Shepherds. They gained mainstream popularity from the series Game of Thrones. 11. Sarlu's Wolf Dog the Sarlu's Wolf Dog is one of the more high wolf content hybrid dog breeds. While its temperament can display both gentle, German Shepherd-like behaviors as well as a more instinctual, wolf side, owning a Sarlu's is best for adult dog owners, aka no kids, with a lot of experience. After all, the Sarlu's came to be by the crossbreeding of German Shepherd with the Eurasian Grey Wolf, making it one of the most similar breeds to wolves in terms of DNA. 10. Siberian Husky The Siberian Husky is the first wolf-like dog that everyone thinks of. The Siberian Husky is also the most popular dog breed on this list and one of the most common family dogs too. He is a vocal and funny canine who loves to be the center of attention. Huskies also love to be cuddled by his humans. He originates from the cold lands of Siberia, where his purpose was to pull heavy sleds across vast icy expanses. Carrying both people and goods, this guy has stamina and strength. 9. Alaskan Noble Companion Dog Alaskan Nobles are a considerably new type of hybrid canine, recognized for their stunning appearance and close resemblance to wolves. They're a crossbreed of Siberian Husky, German Shepherd, Alaskan Malamute. There are conflicting reports about whether or not these dogs carry wolf content. Do they make a good family pet? Not enough is known about the Alaskan Noble at this point. They have been reported as being very affectionate, laid back, and playful with their owners. 8. Native American Indian Dog Indigenous to the U.S., the first thing you'll notice about any Native American Indian dog is that they are very athletic-looking and strong. Historically, they have been used as working dogs, helping humans out with search and rescues, hunting, and more. This dog breed is a great choice for families with young kids, but be sure you understand just how much exercising these dogs need. Any under-exercising could potentially lead to destructive behaviors. 7. Alaskan Malamute The Alaskan Malamute is the Husky's big brother, so big that he can be twice as heavy as the Husky. 
His larger body is covered in extra fluffy fur, so if you aren't a fan of lots of dog hair, you might not want to invite this gorgeous boy into your home. He is super cuddly and affectionate, so if you've ever fancied cuddling a wolf, this is probably your closest and safest chance. He is like the husky but much calmer in the home, like a gentle giant. The Malamute originates from Alaska, and he was used by the Alaskan tribes to pull heavy carts between tribes. Six Swedish Valhund. Valhund translates to herding dog, and that's exactly what they do. Originally developed to herd cows and referred to the Swedish cow dog, this is a rare breed that is believed to have originated thousands of years ago. Do they make a good family pet? Absolutely! They're playful, loving, loyal, and fun! They still having some herding instinct and are considered work dogs that need a high level of exercise and stimulation. They are noisy and known to bark excessively, therefore do not make good apartment pets. 5. Utonigan The Utonigan is a wolf-like dog with a big fluffy coat and a sweet personality to match. Utonigan is a newer crossbreed introduced to the UK in the 1980s, which again is a mix of Malamute, Siberian Husky, and German Shepherd. They got their breed name from a tale passed on by, where Utonigan translates to Spirit of the Wolf. Similar to a Tamascan's temperament, they are curious, affectionate, loyal, and playful, but require daily training and exercise. They have plenty of personality and are very receptive to their owners, which makes them easy to train. 4. Kugshaw the Kugshaw Wolf Dog, or Amerindian Malamute, was first called the American Husky. Very little is known about the Kugshaw Dog, except that it seems to hail from three wolf hybrid breeders in Pennsylvania. Owners say that Kugshaw puppies are incredibly intelligent with a longer attention span than the average young dog. Kugshaw are shy with strangers, but are not known to be aggressive. In the right environment, with strong leadership, they can be excellent companions. 3. Samoyed The Samoyed is a heavenly canine cloud that loves to cuddle. He is another ancient sled dog who can pull one and a half times his weight, which was to cuddle his human pack during the freezing nights to keep them warm, which is why their love of humans is so strong. This is also why he makes a great family companion today. The Samoyed is very similar looking to the wolf, but his coat is much fluffier. If you aren't a fan of the remnants of a white coat on your outfit or furniture, this boy is not for you because he is a heavy shedder. 2. Tamascan Tamascans are dogs that were specifically bred to look like wolves, mixed with Husky, German Shepherd, and Czechoslovakian wolf dogs. Tamascans tend to have a thick coat and straight, bushy tail, making them very wolf-like. The Tamascan is a good family dog, being gentle with children and accepting of other dogs. His high intelligence makes him an excellent working dog and the Tamascan has been known to exceed in agility and obedience as well as sled racing. This pack dog prefers not to be left alone for long periods of time. It is better suited to other human or canine company. Be sure you are this dog's pack leader, providing plenty of daily mental and physical exercise to avoid separation anxiety. When we humans live with dogs, we become their pack. The entire pack cooperates under a single leader. 1. Czechoslovakian Wolf Dog A new dog breed that was created to have the temperament of a German Shepherd, but the physical build and strength of a Carpathian Wolf. 
Originally bred to be attack dogs in Czechoslovakia in the 1980s, the Czechoslovakian wolf dog are now used for a range of work. Do they make a good family pet? Yes, but these dogs require a high level of training and strong leadership. They can be good with children, but are suspicious of strangers. Czech wolf dogs are active and playful and need daily stimulation to feed their curious minds. The problem with adopting a wolf dog. If you are still convinced that you want a wolf hybrid rather than a wolf-like dog, please do some more research before you get one and add to the wolf hybrid sanctuary problem. They are not like domesticated dogs at all, and they are not suited to the vast majority of families. Be careful where you adopt from. Many for-profit breeders will purposely misinform you, but by the time you realize it they're long gone. So, which incredible wolf dogs on this list do you want to own? We're waiting for your answers in the comments. As always if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button, share with your friends and check out another videos on Theraplanet. Thanks for watching.